Jake. Um, the whole go kart process kind of uh, happened it was, by accident. <laughs> <laughs> we we didn't really intend to really like do this much on a go kart. We're just thinking like, oh, we'll get we'll go out and just get a really old crappy go kart and weld weld some things to it and drive it around. Oh, but <laughs> it ended up being a lot more than that. Oh my gosh! Once we finished something, there was not another thing to do. Kept going all the way to the end. There's still things to do on it. Yeah, it won't end. I don't think it'll ever end. Probably not. But basically, we were just trying to find a project, and I was just like, "Let's do a go kart." And we both thought that I, I said was no. kidding. Yeah, I said no. <laughs> we both thought that I was joking. And then we had nothing to do, so we looked up on Craigslist some go karts, and we found this really beat up one for two hundred and fifty dollars. Bought it. Might as well do it. Yeah, might as well. Did it, or bought it, took us about two months to yeah. finish. It's a long project. Yeah. Probably, probably the sanding part. Yeah, it, it was really like, was. We, were, we, we took it to my house over a weekend, and we were standing, while we were standing, we were just like blaring Blasted music. music. We were like, <laughs> <laughs> singing along. Had a bunch of pop. It was like Basically it was kind of just, kind of just like hanging out, standing, having fun. All those, the standing part wasn't really. It was probably like, the worst. Standing, the part. <laughs> standing, it wasn't fun, but it was fun just because we just like got to hang out. Yeah. And it wasn't like, oh, we need to get this done super fast. Yeah. So I think that was probably the best part. Probably good. Yeah. The rest of it was kind of stressful almost on me. Yeah, welding had to be like pretty much perfect on everything. Any mess ups, we'd have to grind off. Thankfully. Yeah, a few times, but yeah, everything else was really stressful, so. <laughs> Probably, I would say, realizing the change. That was just weird. Uh, well, that, that, and that took us a day, not even a day. Yeah. Because Mr. Garrett was helping us with that. But um, I think the part that would I guess the most, the more stressful part, the part that's like, oh, I need to get this perfect, was the roll bars, because you have to get the bends exactly the same, and like make sure the bars are exactly, they're not exactly the same, they're close. We, we had a freehand it too. Yeah. You yeah. put it in it, and then spin it around to, it, we basically just there's, Yeah, there's, there's no measurements on there, it's just like something you can bend metal with. Yep. And so, so we had to try to do that, get it exact, with that until and score. yeah, and the welds had to be good. Yeah. Sturdy. That was probably the most stressful part. I, I, I didn't enjoy doing that part really. Once but we got it, once we got the hang of it, though, it went fast. fast. We had to do a lot of tests on it because we had no idea how it worked.